Hello everyone. Oh, today we're doing another let's play Vincent. Let's have Vincent play his own game. Hold on a second. A little bit pissed because uh, you know I, I just uh, did this video just right now, and I forgot to press the the record button, so I have to do this again. It happens, you know. It has to happen at some point, uh, you know. Uh, when you make videos, don't be discouraged, you know. Just keep going, and then, uh, yeah, just keep going. So today I was going to, uh, yeah, I, I I wanted to play a game. Uh, the world is in your hand. Okay, let's play it. The world is in your plan. Let's uh, look at the description. Uh, this was my first Ludum Dare game, so. Uh, this is for the first time I decided, okay, I'm going to participate in Ludum Dare. Uh, so it means that for 48 hours during one weekend, I'm going to play, I'm going to make a game, everything from scratch. So I just started with drawing the, the little characters and then um, coming up with the idea and then even make the music and everything and put everything into one game. It was a very fun experience, my first time uh, uh, making a uh, Ludum Dare game. The theme was minimalism, uh, so it's actually a, a game where uh, I thought that you know, in this game you only press one button, so that's the part that is minimalism. But what's interesting also is the character inside the game also can only press one button, so you're actually leaving, <laughs> leaving the, that character. Uh, what else can I say about this game? Yeah, you, you know. It's the first time I really like, uh, you know, usually I like to make uh, funny games, you know, like with uh, very uh, silly characters and fun graphics. But uh, this time I opted for um, a little bit serious approach. I don't know why, I just thought this really fit at that time. So yeah, this was like, a, this is like a little bit serious game, a little bit emotional. Uh, some people have actually made videos out of it, so. Yeah, this got uh, some interest. Let's just go for it, okay? All right, press space. Try to skip the intro. We're not gonna skip the intro. I'm just gonna go through it. Yeah. All right, the doctor comes and say, "Hello, I'm your doctor. You are recovering from a tragic accident. Unfortunately, your body body has been paralyzed, and you will only be able to use your right hand. That's uh, some people have that." You know, they had accident and the whole body paralyzed and they can only either like blink the eye or move one hand. That's that's very tragic. I'm wondering, you know, that the people who can only um, move one hand, they can actually play this game. So if they did, you know, maybe they would be inspired. Uh, you feel physical pain. Device for once for yes, twice for no. No, I don't feel pain, just feel sadness. I'll press twice. If you do, please contact me now. Make sure to get some rest, okay? Make, get some rest. So yeah, you press twice, once for yes, twice for no. Darling, it's me. Okay, yes. I know I have not been present lately to take care of you. Are you upset? Yes, I'm upset. Yes, you should take care of me. What have you been doing, you know? I understand. I hope you can forgive me. The reason I was not around is because I was making something for you. Ah, would you like to see it? So, <laughs> I expect the players to put yes here, you know. Uh, but if you actually put no here, it's game over. <laughs> I thought that was a little nice uh, funny touch. So yeah, you do, you say no and then she goes away and she's like, oh, whatever. You know, <laughs> call me when you grow up <laughs> or something. Yeah. But I'm gonna put yes, okay? I don't want to go through the intro again. This, this is a pretty long intro, okay? I hope you like it. Wait here. Yes, I wait here. Ah, it's a chair. Darling, the world is in your hand. <laughs> ah, can you imagine? So why you been uh, in the hospital, uh, you know? all your pain, your wife built you a flying chair. <laughs> what a sweet wife. You know, that makes up for all the time that you haven't been visiting me at the hospital. Ah, I should, okay. So you see, you can, uh, 
I wanted to uh, go there, but I couldn't. Okay. You can visit this world. It's a pretty big world, but uh, there's only like three tasks to do in this world. So I'm just gonna do them one by one. Our first task is gonna be uh, to uh, help that boy that you saw earlier. So here's a tree, and here's a boy. Okay, yes. Oh yeah, the boy. The boy drawing our chair. The boy he keep looking at uh, that direction, you know, up. So um, something interesting about that tree. So let's see. We're gonna go to that tree. This game, I've seen people play this game in a video and they spend a long time roaming around. I mean, if you don't know what to do, you can spend a lot of time. And plus, you keep bumping into the wall. Hey, boy, you got your tree, now you're happy, right? There could be a little bit more indication that uh, something is happening. <laughs> now I'm just like... Uh... Yeah, I don't show anything. Oh, there's like something interesting there. You see there's a woman and she's staring at the, that moose. Something might be interesting there. Just keep watching to find out. Let's see what's next. Actually, you're gonna find out right now because I'm gonna do the next mission. The next mission, there's a boy. Uh, okay, it's at the bottom. See this little red area? The color was chosen uh, very interestingly, you know, like there's the red, that it's like darkness, like very, means like kind of like he's in hell. But we're gonna get him out of hell. Alright, come with me. And yes, you're gonna join me, we're gonna travel the world together and we're gonna find what you're looking for. Some And somebody at the blue area, blue is like sadness. So there's somebody who's very sad, but we're gonna help them out. We're gonna bring, bring happiness into this world. You know, I make those. Ah, I, I, I no. Okay, let's go around again. I missed my mark. Um. So, I make those games. You know, it's because, uh, like, I don't like. Um, I like to bring optimism, you know, into this world. So that. Oh yes. And then the boy. The boy get reunited with his father, and we're gonna see the result of that in a little bit. Very shortly, I think it's next. Ah, yeah. Oh no, it's not yet. We have the bed with our wife uh, sleeping in there. Who, uh, yeah, she must be tired, you know. She's been working very hard to build that uh, flying chair for us. Not a very, um, not an easy feat. Not, not an easy uh, task to do. What else? Okay, let's keep going. Oh, I want to show you the, the that thing that we saw earlier, the tree with the noose. Ah, here it is! Oh, yes, yes! Ah, so that scene earlier when you saw the noose, that was not a noose, that was like uh, to put the, the little tire and put, put that little game thing. So now we've uh, reunited that family. So two, two achievements already, and we're gonna, we're gonna do the last one. Let's see. So you see, like this man who uh, couldn't, who's paralyzed his whole body. He's on a flying chair, helping people. This is uh, this is. Yeah. All right. And last person, little girl, come to my chair. Yes, she noticed us. All right, she's coming. Ah, you want to see that cat, right? Up, oh, yes. Okay. Ah, I wanted to show more about of that. <laughs> Let me come back. So I'm showing off my game, okay? So I need to show some animation. Okay, you woke up, but I'm gonna back up, come back to you. I just wanna see that little girl. The controls in these games, they are a little bit horrible. I must admit. But you know, what can you do, you know, this is a, a game where you have to play the whole game with only one button. So that was uh, pretty hard to uh, figure out how to achieve that, you know. You have to be able to go up and go forward at the same time. Okay, now we reach the end. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes, uh, yes. Darling, <laughs> I achieved my, I'm done with the day, I achieved my mission, now come to me. 
Hey, yeah, the end. <laughs> Cute, isn't it? Ah, the end. The world is in your hand. Again by Vincent Le Quang. Vincent Le Quang, that's me. Produced in 48 hours for Ludum Dea Compo 26 Minimalism. This is like really uh, legit, you know. I did everything in 48 hours. Art and code built in Flash, music composed in GarageBand. Game website. Do not follow this link, okay? Dobuki.com does, does not belong to me anymore. Now it's Dobuki.net, alright? Um, I mean, just go there and then eventually you can find the game, but the link is wrong. I, I will put the right link in the description. And send your comment to Jack Lamster. At gmail.com. This is legit. My email is still Jack Lamster. I mean, that's one of my emails. I have many of them. But Jack Lamster is uh, it's kind of like my game pseudonym. pseudonym. My game's pseudo. Alright, we're done. I hope you have enjoyed uh, this uh, episode of Vincent Places on Game. And I will see you next time for another vlog about something something hope you have a great day bye